Hey church, Corey here. Just wanted to say hi to you and to your loved ones. I hope things are going well. Thank you for the encouragement you continue to give us. Uh, it props us up in so many ways. Missions are going great. Easton Karayama is home and finishing up a 14-day quarantine. She'll start working in the Students International Service Center, which is located right here in Visalia. So she will continue to be a missionary with us. So we're excited about that and for what the future holds for her, a wedding coming up soon. So keep her in your prayers. I've heard from the Wilsons that they too will be uh, moving back to Chico soon. So they'll be leaving Nicaragua for Chico. Uh, be praying for them as they make this transition. Be praying for the DeVries family as they transition to Southern California and continue to save and to plan ahead for what's to come for them in Birmingham uh, for missions. Continue to pray for those missionaries and all of our other missionaries. For Satellite, we keep meeting in the wild, so it's a lot of fun each Thursday night to have worship and the word outdoors. We're being safe. Continue to pray for our young adults. There's some opportunities coming up that I want to talk to you about praying for specifically for our young adults. There is the possibility of a fall camp with Heartland Christian Camps that we're looking into. So be praying about that. It may or may not happen. Of course, we know the world we live in, uh, so be praying about that. And if an opportunity presents itself and we could do it and we're supposed to do it, we will. We'll move forward. So thank you for your prayers and the way you prop us up. We appreciate it. Mary had a little lamb, little lamb, little lamb. Mary had a little lamb. Its fleece was white as snow. And everywhere that Mary went, her lamb was sure to go. That reminds me of John chapter 10 when Jesus says, I am the good shepherd. My sheep hear my voice. They follow me too. See, what do we do during this time of COVID? We follow the good shepherd. And what is he doing? He's doing what he's always done. He's reaching out into darkness, rescuing people from the domain of darkness. And when they come out and they embrace him, embrace the light, they are building him up. And I want to encourage you, continue to pray. Continue to pray that God brings people into your life who need him. Well, that's everybody, right? But those who have yet to make a decision and those who make the decision, Ask the Lord to help you to build them up. Hey, when we have gatherings like the high school did last week, go to it. When men and ironworks meet, go to them. When we do it on Zoom, be there. Be there to encourage and strengthen one another. Because see, that's what Jesus is doing. And as good little sheep, let's follow him. Blessings. Love you guys. Hey, church family. We hope that we see you this Friday night at our drive-in movie. It's going to be a lot of fun, and we're super excited for it. It's going to be this Friday at 8.30. Here at this campus, the South Campus, 2525 South Lover's Lane at 8.30. At 8.30. We already said that. <laughs> We're watching the new Lion King. Not the old Lion King. <laughs> Not the King. 90s one. <laughs> no <laughs> cartoons. Live action. Yes. It's awesome. They use real animals. They do. They find animals that talk. Amazing. Oh, it's amazing. A Maybe it's CGI. Training going Only on Disney this. can do that. It's pretty amazing. It's going to be a great uh, family. Bring your own snacks and popcorn and drinks and all of that. And we've got an FM transmitter. And so it's all going to be through the radio, just like the old days of the drive-in movies. It's going to be a lot of fun. So we're looking forward to seeing you guys, and we hope you can make it out. And, and invite friends. Invite friends, invite yeah. Invite neighbors, all yep. that stuff. It's going to be great. Yep. So right. we'll see, see you this later. Friday. See you then. Bye. Hi friends, Christine here. I'm always so glad to share with you what's going on. I'm especially excited to share with you right now that we will be starting women's Bible studies again. Now, we're gonna start in September, Tuesday night studies, our first and third Tuesdays of the month, we will be starting a Zoom Bible study, as well as September 17, starting our Thursday morning studies again. We are going to start with Zoom, but the hope is, is that that will be very, very short lived and that we can meet together again. I know for some of you, it works so much better actually doing the meeting. So we are gonna continue with the Zoom option, but yes, the hope is, is that we get to meet together again soon. Don't be discouraged. This is gonna be a wonderful time to be together, whether we see each other on a screen or see each other face to face. The bottom line is we get to see each other and we get to grow in the word together. So that is my hope. We will do 2020 by Christine Kane. It looks like it's just gonna be a fabulous study. So I'm looking forward to this. Be ready for some more promo to come. It'll tell you how to sign up. Obviously at this point, we just need your name and your email. So we can do that through the church office, through Natalie or myself. Again, you'll see how to do that soon. Um, so I'm looking forward to it and I'm looking forward to seeing you all. Bye.